Hello ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to an Ultra Confusion interview. This time we have Bloober Team right here, uh, if you could introduce yourselves. Yeah, I'm Michael, I'm a guy from uh, PR. I, I don't want to say my name in Polish because you know it sounds crazy. <laughs> but I'm doing the PR stuff and this is... I'm Andrew, I'm a designer. Okay. Yeah. And we're showing the Brawl. Awesome, okay, so Brawl is a PlayStation 4 exclusive, yep. right? That's right. Um, as far as I know, there's eight characters, eight mm -hmm. character, uh, yeah. eight playable characters. That's right. Um, uh, looks like this is. I, I like this feature of, of your game. Um, you allow for individuals to actually mm -hmm. play yeah. on the same TV. Yeah, that's yeah. right. <laughs> exactly. We're uh, really fans of you know of uh, um, local multiplayer stuff. Right. So the, yeah. the party game. So. Yeah, just a party game. Yeah, uh, and then of course you have the the, the online play for. Um, I'm guessing. What, mm, all the modes? No, no, no. No, no right now we, okay. we got the versus up to four and and duo. Okay. Yeah. So okay, so cool. only two modes for now. Okay. Uh, and okay, we we'll, we we'll show you later. All right. Okay. Cool. Um. So let's see here. So how did you guys start making brawl? Mm. Okay. So the idea was to make a party game mm -hmm. for the PlayStation Four, and actually you know it started before brawl. <clears throat> there was a basement crawl. Mm -hmm. um, we wanted to do a party game, and we wanted to have this game uh, for the launch of PS4 or like launch window, you know, like the three months before uh, or after the release. Mm -hmm. So yeah, so we re wanted really, uh, really bad, to, you know, to, to to have that, and yeah, so we managed to do that, but the game wasn't very good. So that's why we we wanted to you know to to do something about it, you know, mm -hmm. to, to fix it. And we started thinking that, that maybe fixing the game that nobody likes is not the best solution. So we decided to, to make another one that's mm -hmm. completely different. It's not like Brawl is basement crawl fixed or something like that or remastered. Mm -hmm. It's not. It's it's really the new game. Um, with and new that's why with new conce conception on the base gameplay. So okay. yeah. So that's why we wanted to do that. You know. Like there's there are not many party games, mm -hmm. and as you said, it's like unusual to see the uh, game that you can play uh, four players, you know, on the one couch. It's like mm -hmm. this is how we like to play games, right? Is there a plan to like bring it online to more than just local play and do online play also? Yeah, yeah. yeah. There is both possibility to. Yeah, play. there's a, we, we got single player online modes, you know, challenges and stuff like that. So mm -hmm. yeah, uh -huh. but basically, basically, uh, the most important stuff is that. This is the uh, local multiplayer game. So you you said that you have a single player yeah. Um, yeah. version, and I'm, I believe uh, from one of the videos I was watching, you're calling it classic. Mm -hmm. no, 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 sorry, no. Class, classic is no is no it, powers. Is it, yeah, this yeah. is one yeah. of the modes in yeah. right, multiplayer. Right. Uh, so so you have a single player single mode player. for. Uh, I'm assuming that each character has its own yeah. story, right? Yeah, it's, uh, own so story, yeah. with with the the characters are are you, how. How many levels are you are you talking about going through the story? Is it like you know, you you just have like two or three to kind of just get the modes mm -hmm. out of the way and then it's go yeah, into multiplayer? Five or or five uh, levels for for each character, mm -hmm. yeah. and it's a introduction for for playing. Yeah, so mm -hmm. it's kind of tutorial, but you got s some stuff that you don't have in multiplayer. Mm -hmm. So we got boss fights. Okay, boss fights is more like a duel, yeah. Mm -hmm. but yeah. There are, there, are, there are boss fights, uh, there are uh, tower defense, tower defense yeah, okay. kind of missions that you don't have in, in multiplayer. We might mm -hmm. do that sometime, mm -hmm. we will see uh, if people like that. So, you know, the single player is like, for each character you see that uh, it's different. Uh, based, it's because each character has different skills. Mm -hmm. So some of those uh, single player modes, uh, I mean campaigns, uh, some are very heavily action based. Mm -hmm. Uh, action, uh, yeah, and you've got also a stealth kind of, uh, you know, campaign, so mm -hmm. they are pretty different, you know. We wanted to uh, entertain people as much as we could. So you and said... fit skill set for, for uh, this campaign, yeah. how mm -hmm. it looks. Okay. Yeah. So you said uh, all these characters have their own special skills. Yeah. Mm -hmm. right. um, so I was looking at some of them, and, and I can't remember what the character was, but there was one that was like a knife throw and yeah. then a teleport. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's yeah. right. That's so, a so... Is there, like, what kind of skills are we talking about? Are we talking just like all attack base, or or does each character have like an attack base and then like a like a special mm -hmm. skill type? Mm -hmm. Some characters are very focused on, on attacking, mm -hmm. and as you said with the girl, it's like 
the teleport skill is very tactical. Mm -hmm. You know, mm -hmm. uh, it makes the gameplay very tactical, but also very difficult. You have to really master that one. Mm -hmm. And you can use it, uh, you know, to you can when you throw uh, throw this uh, knife and it, it hits mm -hmm. uh, your opponent, you can switch places with uh, with this opponent. So you put two bombs, uh, you know, near you. Wait for uh, two two seconds be before they explode, yeah. and then you teleport, mm -hmm. and that's how you get an easy kill, right? But then again, you can just put the knife anywhere you want and use it as a uh, escape uh, route, yeah. you know. So this is also some. Kind there's of also a counter for it. Yeah. and so there's also counter for that. Yeah. So, so the teleport is just you're switching locations with yeah. the yeah yeah with, with the knife. target. Okay. Yeah, with, with, yeah, that's right. Okay. But you can so just bombs, just opponents. Yeah, you can switch the the places with bombs if you want. Oh, okay. Interesting. Yeah. Um, so, uh, how long have you guys been developing? I know that you said that you had the basement mm -hmm. crawl yeah. and you wanted to, to make a, a new game, Brawl. Yeah. Uh, how long have you, how long has this game been in development? Yeah. Mm. Almost one year. Uh, yeah, one year. Because actually, we had basement crawl, but it, it was a different game. It was the different uh, engine. It was fire. From yeah. Sony, and now we're using Unity. Mm -hmm. um, we ba basically, we had to do this from the beginning. So, we got a concept, and they really prototyped it very mm -hmm. fast, like in one month. One month yeah. yeah, and it works. So yeah, so the especially gameplay. Actually, the, I think that the most time, uh, the yeah, the, the you know, we created the multiplayer right uh, modes right, very fast, mm -hmm. but creating the story mode, mm -hmm. it yeah. took some time. Yeah. Took some, some time because you know it's different for each character. Mm -hmm. Yeah, exactly. you have to plan it. It's not as easy as you know create multiple modes. Also, we got uh, no. narration with the voice of Emporium mm -hmm. during yeah. uh, during single player campaign, and it's a uh, kind of master of puppets feeling. So, mm -hmm. yeah. which which is you know deep deep deep. Right. Yeah, right. and uh, of course the dark humor. It's it's this nar narration is like I think that it, it's kind of like portal stuff. Mm -hmm. You know, like Vladas. So uh, for you example, might Stanley Parable is a good benchmark for it. Yeah, okay. so you might be you might want to you know just to hear those jokes that he's saying you know this not really pleasant stuff. <laughs> it's like making fun of you that you're dying constantly. Yeah, exactly. So yeah, you might try to you know just die on purpose mm -hmm. so you can hear <laughs> what he, what this guy's saying. And since we're talking about him, he's a, it's a voice of Eric Bra. Mm -hmm. He was in the Walking Dead the game and mm -hmm. also in um, League of Legends. Le Le League of Legends, yeah. So. Um, I, it, I, I saw yep. that um, that you guys were. It looked like there was a tournament. Yeah. Yeah, yeah that's right. EM. So cool. Intel Master Extreme I think is obviously the, one of the biggest. Uh, yeah, uh, it was it was the finals of the uh, IEM Intel Extreme Masters, uh, the, the final in. Uh, Katowice in Poland, so <coughs> it was really close to where we are based. Mm -hmm. So uh, yeah, we, we tried. We wanted to see w how people were, uh, you know, do they like the game or not? How will they react to the game? And so we decided to make a, uh, you know, this tournament. Mm -hmm. I know the game is not yet out, so mm -hmm. we just wanted to see if it's easy to pick up and, and play. And yeah, it looks like so, like that. Yeah. So okay, so the the um. With that tournament, yeah. are you guys thinking about maybe doing more tournaments, or is it just kind of? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Are you are you going to try to go more, uh, like I guess deeper into the esports? Mm -hmm. uh, it's a more party game, but it's so competitive. So yeah, mm -hmm. there is a base on for, for uh, uh, esport, but mm -hmm. it's a party game. Yeah, it's right, still right. party game. We'll think we're thinking about it, but uh, basically, you know, we want to make a party game. Mm -hmm. But still, there is this mode that is called Duel. Mm -hmm. uh, that, that this is the mode that they uh, were playing on the uh, IEM, mm -hmm. and this is one one versus one. And yeah, it it can be really you know fast, uh, but still very tactical. So yeah, we're exactly thinking, we're looking into that stuff, but ba mainly it's the party game. We'll see. Is there that anything? Yeah, I saw there's like a press release about the NVIDIA Shield. Do you have plans to bring us to other platforms? Because they're mm -hmm. saying that it's coming to like the Shield. Okay, yeah. so, okay. So, so we're focusing now on PlayStation 4, and, and this is the exclusive right, yep. for PlayStation 4. But of course, we're looking uh, in some other possibilities. Mm -hmm. I don't know what you guys saw, but okay. <laughs> 
That was, well, it was from like just... Reuters.com. They said like there was a press release mm -hmm. saying that it was being released okay. on the Nvidia Shield. So. Uh, okay. Nice. Yeah, that was kind of curious because I knew I saw it was a PlayStation 4 exclusive. I yeah, like, that's weird. PlayStation 4 exclusive. But of course, we wanted to make it for PS4 because of the Basement Crawl, right? Mm -hmm. yeah. So people who bought Basement Crawl. Uh, they are getting bro for free. Mm -hmm. You just but need that account. I, the must, as yeah. I must admit to we, we are preparing version of, of Android. Yeah, cool. yeah, yeah, we're doing something. <laughs> <laughs> um, Let's just focus on our yeah. PS4 version. Yeah, and PlayStation 4. Talk, you know. so, so with with the PlayStation 4 version, uh, yeah. there's there's eight characters and from my understanding, 20 different arenas mm -hmm. or close to that. Yeah, um, for, for versus is a it's, So is there... Um, is there plans to me to potentially like expand on like adding extra characters mm. into it, or is it eight characters and that's it? We can only eight characters, but maybe 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 later we, we will yeah. update it. Okay. Yeah, we, we we think about we think about that stuff. You know, basically what we want to do now is to, you know release the game and see mm -hmm. how how it goes. Mm -hmm. if people like it or, or not. You know, it's it's been a long time since the since the time when we said that we'll make another one. Uh, another game, like, we will make Brawl mm -hmm. and, and give it to people who bought Best Control. It's been like a year now, so we just really want to, you know, uh, pu publish that and mm -hmm. release that and then wait what what's going to happen, right? So we've got some plans for, for another multiplayer modes, but mm -hmm. yeah, but yep. we just want to do that, you know, and but see how it goes. With those eight characters, like I see online, it's like a cross, you guys call it a cross between a MOBA and um, yeah. Bomberman. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Well, you know, you play MOBA, you kind of have skill ceilings for different characters. Like, mm -hmm. this is easy, medium, hard to play. Yeah. Kind of eight characters, you now created them. Did you kind of take in, like, the skill levels? So you kind of have, like, different characters from mm -hmm. different skill levels? Kind yeah. of the same idea? Um, so some are easier to play, some maybe a little bit harder, but... Yeah. but better yeah. if, if you master them. Yeah. Yeah. There are some characters that might be difficult to, to, mm -hmm. to play for the for execution for start. Of, of those skills are the are same. Yeah. So... So you always use like the, like the same like buttons. Smash Bros. Okay. That was basically the idea that you don't have to learn how to play, mm -hmm. you know, physically. You don't have to, you know, press this button for, for putting a bomb and another, you know, when you're playing a different character. So that was the idea that it's going to be, whatever character you play, it's always using those same, the same buttons. Yeah. So right? it's easy to play, yeah. but hard, hard to master. It's quite okay. hard to master, yeah. You, you, you're going to see when... Uh, <laughs> Andrew is pretty good at that, so... <laughs> <laughs> he will, so, um, he will so come. you got you have all these different modes. Yeah. Um, what personally is your favorite mode to play? Um, okay, I think that it's quite easy question because I really like color domination, mm -hmm. and the color domination because you don't really have to know the game very much to mm -hmm. to enjoy it and mm -hmm. even to win. And I, since I'm not as good player as Andrew, I have a chance to win that. You know, <laughs> playing in the studio, there are some not very much. hardcore guys. <laughs> yeah, yeah. not too much. He's still good at it. And then, what's yours? I, I like versus and, and endless challenge of a fort. Yeah, mm -hmm. got it. So, you, you know, there is a call. So, mm -hmm. yeah, that's. Is there, that's is there um, like, a. a when you you can play up to four, uh, you can play up with four people. Yeah. Is there a is there an AI bot system mm -hmm. for right. if you're okay? Yeah. yeah so so there are always four characters on screen. Okay. If mm -hmm. you, if you play like alone, there'll be you know they'll be controlled by mm -hmm. AI. So in the the dual mode. Yeah. Um, are we talk? Are, is it the same arenas that you could play in like the versus mode? Or no, is no, it? no, it's smaller. Okay. Yeah, very really smaller. You know to be. We right. want the gameplay to be faster. Right, right. And there is a run system, no the, the yeah, time well, limited. Mm -hmm. So you're playing, you, you have to win three rounds. Mm -hmm. And when it's tied, like uh, you win two and your opponent win two rounds, there's the special final round when there are no boxes, you know, crates on the, on the levels. Just the table crates. Yeah, just, yeah. Mm -hmm. And your attributes are max on, on a start. So, so yeah, you so get two HP. Yeah, because we got also the uh, HP, mm -hmm. the bonus HP. So when you get get hit by the bomb, you you won't die. And you got another chance. Uh -huh. Yeah. So that. Yeah. Is there any kind of like leveling or unlock system as you play the game? Yeah, we got an unlock system. Okay. For example, uh, there is a uh, four uh, available uh, star mode characters mm -hmm. at yeah. the start, and then you have to unlock. unlock. Uh, the other four. The okay, other cool. four, yeah. And also, we got the collectible points. Yeah. And you can uh, uh, 
spend it, yeah, spend on, it on some other. art, yeah, art artwork, models, artworks, yeah, 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 models, yeah, yeah. In gallery. but n no leveling for your characters. I mean, basically, you you cannot be, you know, have the like stronger character that mm -hmm. always starts with two H the HP. It's not, mm -hmm. not, it's not like that. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh I've got one more question. And yeah. Oh, wait on a sec. Okay. Oh, this guy reads chicken scratch. Yeah, okay. I know. No problem. <laughs> um, so, I guess um, mm -hmm. my only, la my last question is, um, so you also have a mode called Sumo. Yeah, we've got Sumo. And Sumo is, it, I'm, you're, you're just pushing characters mm -hmm. around. Yeah, so is there, right. um, I didn't actually see any footage of Sumo. So mm -hmm. are you trying to knock them off the level? Yeah, or? that's right. Yeah, that's right. Okay. That's what you're trying and, to do. And, and, space and, and, and yeah. is Sumo only for like a, like one versus one? Or no, 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 it's, it's four. four. Up, up to four? four? Yeah. Wow. One versus one is all, only the dual mode. Okay. Yeah. Wow. So that's it. We wanted, you know, to, to make something different than, than just, you know, Mm -hmm. Blowing your friends out. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like fun anyway. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. exactly. Okay, um, um, I think I'm done with the brawl questions. I do, I do want to get a couple of uh, personal questions in for you guys. Mm -hmm. here. Okay. That, that, of course, is sure. so. Let's, um, let's try doing. What, what got you into making video games? Okay, so you want to start with that? Mm -hmm. well, I, I, I can, okay. <laughs> Actually, uh, I was a j journalist mm -hmm. uh, for. Like uh, ten years, so I, you know, I always liked games. I loved them very much. I uh, played them a lot, so it was like no-brainer for me that I would go. I would really lo love to go to mm -hmm. into the industry, and I had a chance to, you know, to work and the, at the in the printed magazine and two online, you know, uh, websites outlets. So it was very good for me, but I wanted to change something, mm -hmm. and that's why I had, uh, you know, tried it. Just, just reach for that, right? I just tried to be in the in the game development. Still, I understand that you know PR is not strictly the, <laughs> the development, but yeah. yeah, I'm working with the team so very closely on the next project. So yeah, this is this is my way, and I was a game tester back then as well. So it's a good start if you are because Andrew was a game tester as well. <coughs> so yeah, I met my, my friend. And he said to me that uh, he he's on a QA in Nicholas Games, and yeah, this was I, Polish developer. I, I thought, okay, <laughs> you <laughs> can do that. That's 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 my dream. So mm -hmm. uh, I I asked him uh, to, to 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 you know to make an interview. Yeah, re recommendation. Yeah. Recommend me, yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. And and how it start? Is it in my opinion is it very good for uh, you know no. How big is is the game? Yeah, is how they're the gonna keep QA. Yeah, so how the process uh, how, how the, the process works, works, yeah, yeah. Right. how it looks like, yeah, you know, but get the basic idea. Of, yeah, you know, every how, aspect of game. So yeah, it's road, right. it's animation, and uh, other stuff. So and the design, yeah, models, that's right. and this is this everything. Thing. So, if you are looking for a place, you know, to work uh, at the <coughs> QA, so don't don't go to the uh, you know those outsource uh, you know companies. I mean, they are also good, right, very good. Right. But if you b want to be very close with the development uh, team, so just try to find a place. Maybe mm -hmm. it probably it's easier in Poland than in here. But <laughs> yeah, but still, uh, just just try to do that. Well, I, I'm, I'm from personal experience. I know that it is yep. quite challenging to get okay. into the industry. Mm -hmm. um, even if you were once upon a time in the industry, I was okay. actually a developer for mm -hmm. oh, really? two years. Awesome! And then uh, the company closed down, and I have not been able to get back in since. Oh my god! Yeah, so it, it is it is challenging, especially in Atlanta, because Atlanta's not yeah. you know it's not like a, uh, California or Seattle where yeah. you have tons and tons of companies that you can go to. But so what, I, ab what about going indie? You thought about it? I, I've I thought know, I thought about you it. Still, you still need money. Yeah, I know, yeah, but. and 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 I think uh, that's that's part of what. What uh, I've ended up doing for Indie for Ultra Confusion is yeah. uh, we focus more on the independent developed games awesome. uh, to try to give at least you know a little love, a little um, uh, you know say something about the game, yeah. review the game, throw it out there. The publicity. Oh yeah. yeah, and I tell you what, it is much better to work with Indies than it is with the AAA titles because okay. if you give the mm -hmm. AAA titles a bad review, they'll scream and yell at you. If you give an yeah. Indie a bad review, like. 
Thank you for being honest. Thank you for being honest. I, okay. under, I understand mm -hmm. where you're coming from. So, uh, but but that's I mean we've uh, Ultra Confusion. That's really where uh, that's until mm -hmm. I get back into the industry. Mm -hmm. That's where yeah. I'm spending most of my time with the indies and whatnot. Cool. Awesome. Awesome. Um, okay. So, uh, uh, interesting question for you. Okay. If you could, yeah, make a new version of any game, what would it be? <laughs> oh my. <goodness. laughs> Half-Life 3. <laughs> Half-Life 3. That, that would be awesome. Come a lot on. of people would be happy. Yeah. It's my opinion. It's the most immersive first person ever. Yeah. yeah. Half-Life is insane. I don't know. Mm. <laughs> That's really, really tough question. <laughs> I have no idea. I just, I just know the games that I would really would like to, you know, to be a part of the team. Mm -hmm. like, New Dark Souls. Maybe. Yeah, of course I, I love Dark Souls, but come on. It's, it, I can't. I wouldn't be able to do anything better, you know, than, <laughs> so I can't say that. I would like to do, you know, the new version of that because a harder well, version of Dark Souls. Yo, no, there's no such thing. I. What was the first one? Demon Souls. Demon Souls. I, yeah. I played that one. Yeah. And I cried. <laughs> okay. Because 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 the 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 beauty about that game was yeah. that you. You're gonna suck at the game because you suck. Yeah. It's not the game being cheap. Yep, yeah, that's right. And so, <laughs> I, I yeah, I had to give up on that. Oh, I had come to, on. You have to play that. <laughs> <laughs> um, any questions? I think you got most of them covered. Yeah. So, okay. Okay. So what? so maybe I'll just. Well, I thought about the game. It was okay. so so long ago. It was called Firelight. I don't know if I remember. Okay. It was for Commodore 64. Or maybe, or maybe Spectrum. I'm not. I'm not <laughs> quite sure now. But yeah, I just I remember that the game was so awesome. I, I really like to see the new version of that. I know that um, for him and for me, yeah. a game that we would we would love to see at least the rebirth of. I would love to be on yeah. the team. Mm -hmm. But uh, there was a PC game called um, Master of Magic. Master yes, of Magic. Magic. Oh, okay. Which was basically, mm -hmm. I guess, the uh, basically used. The civilization engine, yeah. uh, but but you know had like you know mm -hmm. dragons and unicorns and stuff yeah. like that. Oh, I want that back. They've that tried over the years. Well, there They've was a game that came it. out uh, that was supposed to be the spiritual successor. Mm -hmm. uh, I was supposed to, actually it was supposed to have Master of Magic in the title, but the mm -hmm. the licensing dropped out at the last minute. It was called Elemental. It's one of the worst releases ever because there was okay. nothing in that game. Don't don't know that. Uh, yeah, and so it's good. Uh, it's don't, good to, don't, don't don't play that game. Okay. Okay. Um. So. From our understanding, mm -hmm. that um, uh, we get to see a little peek here. So yeah. uh, let's uh, let's reset to do a, a little peek, and then we'll we'll continue with the stream. Uh, but uh, cool. uh, for this section, I want to thank you guys for for coming out yeah, and, thank you for and uh, answer some of our questions. And I can't wait to actually uh, get to play this game. Now, the release date for uh, yeah. the PlayStation Four is mm -hmm. coming up soon. Isn't yeah, it? yeah, yeah, very soon. Like twenty fourth. The twenty fourth. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, there you go. Yeah. So, so the so le just let me say that the, yeah. the game will be the nineteen ninety nine. But but for the first month, it's gonna be fourteen ninety nine. Mm. Uh, of course, it's gonna be free for everyone who bought Basement Crawl. But you need to use the account, you know, that the Basement Crawl is assigned to. Mm -hmm. So yeah, that's 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 basically it, right? That makes sense. And j just play it with your friends. Like it's a party game. Actually, that, that does remind me of one thing. Yeah. Uh, a question yeah. that we did, that we were uh, we were thinking about asking was, so you have this online mode. Yeah. Um, is the online mode for friends only, or can you get um, we, uh, we random can, assignment? You can invite yeah, yeah. friends and play together. But get, well, is there like a random assignment as well? No, we, there will be a matchmaking. Okay. Yeah. Okay. okay. Awesome. Well, okay. Uh, thanks again for coming out. Uh, this is... Bloober team, yeah, their, right. ta their game Brawl, uh, and we're about to get into it. So um, let's reset, and then uh, we'll continue cool. with the stream. So cool. awesome. Thanks. Thanks.